Welcome back to another video. You know, I, I would say that I'm addicted to this game. While well, addicted is going a little bit overboard. I like this game a lot. Definitely play it a lot when I can. When there's a lot to do inside of it. Because the game is fun. There's a lot of challenges and other stuff like that inside of the game. You know, strong enemies, losing a lot, but then eventually winning it. It's a good feeling when you finally beat a challenge that you've been trying to do for so long. But there's a, a big issue here. For me, at least. That is the resource farming. I absolutely despise farming the resources inside of this game the fact that i am level 47 at the moment and i still just get barely anything from beating the second to highest difficulty and a lot of the farming stuff and still barely get any drops i spend all 180 of my stamina to get one character barely anywhere if i farm for exp i go from level 50 to 54 after using like 60 stamina if i want to farm for traces talent levels and stuff like that that, I, I only level up like one after using 60 stamina. And I don't mean level up one all the way to max. I mean like level up one by one level. It, it's very annoying to deal with. It's like I have a lot of characters that I have to build because I want to be able to beat Abyss. I can't beat Abyss. I still have to beat this shit. I'm pretty sure a lot of other people still have quite a bit of things to do because they're not absolutely no lifing the game. I already explained last video why I was playing the game as much as I was playing in the first place. Now that I have that, I don't really have that much of a reason to play the game as much, but I'm still gonna be playing it. There's a lot of leveling, but not enough stamina, not enough resource drops. I could just be spending all of this time trying to get some stuff for my traces. I need a lot of blue, but instead they give me a lot of green. Why do, why do we still get green EXP tickets? I can understand, you know, getting less purple but a lot more blue, but the fact that I'm getting like one purple, couple blue, and like a lot of green that, that, I don't like that. I'm doing the second highest difficulty. I told myself, you know, I hope this gets better once I get to level 50. You know, increase my world level and whatnot. I was told that once you get to 50, it doesn't really get any better. I'm not even gonna go to max copium and be like, well, I hope it gets better once I get to 60. But I can definitely do Abyss, but I want to be able to three-star Abyss. I don't want to continue on unless I three-star it. I just want to be able to play the game longer than 10 minutes and then having to just get off because because no more stamina. I'm not max refreshing either. I'd rather not do that. If I was max refreshing every day, I would be well over 50 by now. Like one of my buddies who really needs to get off the game. That guy is level 55. Hell, he's probably even close to being level 60 or 56, I should say. I know, I know. You're probably just like, ah, oh, you should just go outside. I don't like it outside. I don't, what if I don't want to go outside? I mean, like, there's other games that I could be playing, sure. But you know, actually finally being able to do something new. There's other things that I want to be able to do inside of the game, but it's going to take a while because I don't have the goddamn resources to do it. Also, I absolutely despise the relic farming inside of the game. I, I hate relic farming more than anything else inside of the game right now. Well, actually, that's a lie. Relic farming and farming for trace levels, I don't like it. The amount of HP and death percent that I get on a daily basis when I go farm for that shit is just, I don't like it. I hate it so much. But that's, that's more of a personal thing and a luck issue than it is a game issue. I would hope that it's just a luck issue and not a game issue. And people aren't going through the same thing that I'm going through. At this point, I'm just having PTSD of Genshin. I can't really say that the game is dead and it's moving slow. I mean, like, the game just fucking released. Not saying that the game is bad or anything like that. I mean, like, it's it's still pretty early game. So I can't make too many assumptions. I, I still think the game is pretty fun. Otherwise, I literally would not play the game. I would like to be able to do Abyss, finish it off entirely, but, you know, the last two floors, 14 and 15, I would like to be able to get those over with. It's taking forever for me to actually build my goddamn units. Patience is key, as they say, but I, I really don't have the patience. Also, this video is sponsored by no one. So you can fix that by subscribing. Thank you. There's no possible way that I'm actually going to be able to beat this shit, but I guess we can try anyway. <laughs> Of course, I don't crit at the most important time. Now you've done it! You won't like Doc when he's angry! <laughs> Shoot! 
I know I should have saved that. I don't even know why I used that. And now I'm just dead. I think the game's difficulty is fine. Game mechanics is fine. The farming, I just, I can't get around right now. The farming is the only thing that makes me wonder if I even want to continue to play the game during that day, not like period, but during that day. I can't recall if it's as bad inside of Genshin at the beginning because I've been max level inside of Genshin for so damn long. I'm gonna try this one more time. It was a very sad time when I found out that Abyss actually needed two teams. I assumed that I would not need such things. It seems like I was really stupid to assume that. To be honest, I could make my life a whole lot easier and just summon for Jing, but I kind of don't really want him like that. I don't I don't really care much. <laughs> All right, we're back here again. Let's give this one last try. If I get it, I get it. If I don't, well, fuck. やり先に火を炎の襟を。立ち切れ。いい。いや。やり先に火を炎の襟を。立ち切れ。いい。いや。All right. Oh my god, I actually did it. I had to like focus, focus, so I do not mess up. Trying to beat Jeopard. I hate Jeopard. The shielding mechanic that that guy has, I do not like it. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Break effect and death percent. Always, always. I just can't catch a break. I know we have a thing that guarantees us like a certain stat that we want, but we only get it like once a fucking year. That doesn't really help my sanity. Hopefully, this is a thing that we can actually buy like through event shop. Because if it is, that will be a blessing and a fucking half. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you didn't, take your anger out on the like button and sub button. I'll see you again next time.